everyone, welcome back to Adventure Vista. Today we have a video talking about the 15 most amazing ancient ruins in the world. So let's embark on a journey to 15 breathtaking locations where the echoes of past civilizations resonate. From the misty peaks of Machu Picchu to the colossal Great Wall of China, the gladiatorial Colosseum to the rose-hued city of Petra, and the sacred temple of Angkor Wat to the desert oasis of Palmyra, we'll traverse continents and eras. So are you ready to step back in time and explore these wonders? Imagine a city high in the clouds, untouched for centuries. Welcome to Machu Picchu. Nestled amidst the Peruvian Andes, Machu Picchu stands as a silent sentinel, a testament to the grandeur of the Inca Empire. This city, shrouded in mystery, was hidden from the world until its discovery in 1911 by explorer Hiram Bingham. Steeped in history, Machu Picchu showcases the Incan prowess in architecture and astronomy. The intricate stonework, aligned with celestial bodies, echoes the Incan understanding of the cosmos. The terraced fields ripple across the landscape, a testament to their agricultural ingenuity. Machu Picchu is more than just stone and mortar. It's a gateway into the past, a window into the Incan civilization that thrived here over 600 years ago. Its cultural significance resonates even today, a symbol of resilience and innovation. An architectural marvel, Machu Picchu remains a testament to the Incan civilization. From the clouds, we journey to a winding dragon, the Great Wall of China. This massive fortification, a testament to human resilience, was built over several centuries. With its roots in the 5th century BC, the wall showcases the intricate labor of millions of workers from various Chinese dynasties. It was strategically designed to protect the celestial empire from invasions, serving as a robust barricade along the northern borders. Beyond its military purpose, the Great Wall has deeply embedded cultural significance. It is a symbol of China's historical continuity, reflecting the perseverance of its people through time. The wall tells countless stories, each brick whispering tales of the workers who toiled under the sun and moon to erect it. Its undulating path over mountains and through valleys mirrors the highs and lows of China's vast history. The Great Wall, a symbol of perseverance and strength, stretches on as a timeless monument. From the east, we travel to the heart of Rome, the Colosseum. Nestled amidst the hustle and bustle of modern Rome, this ancient amphitheater stands as a testament to the grandeur of the Roman Empire. A marvel of engineering, its construction began under the Emperor Vespasian in the year 72 AD and was completed by his son Titus eight years later. The Colosseum was a stage set for gladiatorial games, a spectacle that drew Romans from all walks of life. From slaves battling for their freedom to wild beasts from the far reaches of the empire, the arena echoed with the clash of steel and the roar of the crowd. This colossal structure was not merely an arena for entertainment, but a symbol of Rome's cultural identity. It showcased the empire's wealth, power, and above all, its mastery over life and death. The Colosseum, once echoing with cheers, stands as a stark reminder of Rome's glorious past. Leaving Rome, we venture to the desert, to the rose city of Petra. Nestled amidst rugged desert canyons and mountains, this ancient city is an archaeological jewel. It was carved directly into vibrant red, white, pink, and sandstone cliff faces over 2,000 years ago by the Nabataeans, an industrious Arab people who settled here more than 2,000 years ago. The city was an important crossroads between Arabia, Egypt, and Syria, Phoenicia. Petra is half built, half carved into the rock, and is surrounded by mountains riddled with passages and gorges. It's a breathtaking marvel of human ingenuity and a testament to the creativity of the Nabataean people. The city is also known for its sophisticated water system, including dams, conduits, and cisterns that help sustain life in the harsh desert. These features are a testament to the Nabataeans' advanced understanding of hydraulics. Carved into the mountains, Petra remains a beautiful mystery to the world. From the desert, we soar to the cradle of Western civilization, the Acropolis. Perched high above Athens, the Acropolis stands as a testament to the intellectual prowess of ancient Greece. The Parthenon, an architectural masterpiece, is the crowning glory of the Acropolis. Carved from pentelic marble, this temple dedicated to Athena, the goddess of wisdom, symbolizes the zenith of the Doric order. But the Acropolis is more than just awe-inspiring architecture. It's where the concept of democracy was born, where citizens gathered to discuss and decide on matters of the state. This was a revolutionary idea, 
a spark that ignited the flame of participatory governance and lit up the world. Ancient Greece's cultural impact resonates even today. Our sciences, arts, philosophy, and politics are deeply rooted in the wisdom of this civilization. The Acropolis, a beacon of wisdom and democracy, overlooks Athens with its timeless grace. Leaving Greece, we travel to the spiritual heart of Cambodia, Angkor Wat. This majestic temple complex sprawling over 400 square kilometers stands as a testament to the grandeur of the Khmer Empire. Originally built in the 12th century as a Hindu temple dedicated to the god Vishnu, it later transformed into a Buddhist temple, reflecting the fluid religious beliefs of the region. The allure of Angkor Wat lies in its intricate carvings, each one telling a story of deities, myths, and the cosmos. These stone scriptures etch the temple's cultural significance into every corner, creating a living tableau of ancient spirituality. But it's not just the past that reverberates through these sacred halls. Today, Angkor Wat remains a place of worship and a symbol of national pride. Its image adorns the country's flag, making it a poignant emblem of Cambodia's enduring spirit. A symbol of Cambodia, Angkor Wat continues to inspire with its intricate carvings and spiritual legacy. From the east, we journey to the New World, to the Maya city of Chichen Itza. Nestled in the Yucatan Peninsula of Mexico, this ancient city was a bustling hub of the Maya civilization. Constructed around the 9th century, its buildings are a testament to the Maya's advanced understanding of architecture and urban planning. At the heart of Chichen Itza stands the Kukulkan Pyramid, an architectural marvel that aligns with the sun during the spring and autumn equinoxes, casting a shadow that creates the illusion of a serpent descending its stairs. This, along with other structures like the Great Ball Court and the Temple of the Warriors, showcases the Maya's deep-rooted connection with astronomy and their cosmos-oriented culture. Chichen Itza was not just a city, it was a center of cultural, political, and economic life for the Maya civilization. Today, its ruins continue to intrigue scholars and visitors alike, providing a window into the past. A marvel of ancient engineering, Chichen Itza stands as a testament to the Maya's astronomical prowess. From the Americas, we return to the Old World, to the timeless pyramids of Giza. These awe-inspiring structures, standing tall on the edge of the western desert, are a testament to the ingenuity and ambition of the ancient Egyptians. Built over 4,000 years ago, the pyramids were erected as grand tombs for the pharaohs, the god kings of Egypt. The largest, the Great Pyramid of Khufu, is one of the seven wonders of the ancient world and continues to astound us with its colossal size and precision. The pharaohs believed in life after death, and these pyramids were a part of their journey to the afterlife, filled with treasures, food, and all the comforts they would need in their eternal rest. Over the millennia, these monumental tributes have weathered sandstorms and invasions, yet they continue to stand, a testament to a civilization that valued the eternal over the ephemeral. The pyramids, a tribute to the pharaohs, continue to captivate us with their enduring mystery. Leaving Egypt, we journey to the crossroads of cultures, Ephesus. Nestled in the heart of modern-day Turkey, Ephesus was a bustling center of trade and culture during the Greco-Roman era. A melting pot of both Greek and Roman influences, its architecture and city planning were a testament to the harmonious blend of these two mighty cultures. Among the city's many marvels, the Library of Celsus stands out. This grand edifice was more than a repository of scrolls. It was a symbol of the city's commitment to knowledge and learning. With its ornate facade and intricate design, the Library of Celsus was a beacon of enlightenment in a city teeming with life and culture. But Ephesus was more than just its buildings. It was a hub of cultural exchange where ideas and philosophies intermingled, shaping the course of history. Once a bustling city, Ephesus remains a gem of Greco-Roman history. From the Mediterranean, we travel to the foggy plains of England, Stonehenge. An enigma of prehistoric times, this ancient monument is a testament to the ingenuity of our ancestors. Built somewhere between 4,000 and 5,000 years ago, Stonehenge is a marvel of engineering, formed from massive stones transported over vast distances. The purpose of Stonehenge remains shrouded in mystery. Some theories suggest it was a temple dedicated to ancestor worship, Others propose it served as an astronomical observatory. This uncertainty only adds to the allure and intrigue of this ancient wonder. Stonehenge holds a significant place in the cultural fabric of England. It's a symbol of endurance, a silent witness to thousands of years of human history. It's a place where the past feels tangible, 
where you can almost hear the whispers of the ancient people who once gathered here. A prehistoric puzzle, Stonehenge continues to mystify and fascinate. Leaving England, we journey to the heart of India, the Taj Mahal. The Taj Mahal is more than an architectural marvel. It's a testament to the power of love. Commissioned by the Mughal Emperor Shah Jahan in the 17th century, it was built in memory of his beloved wife, Mumtaz Mahal. This ivory-white marble mausoleum took over two decades to complete, with skilled artisans from across Asia contributing to its intricate design. The Taj Mahal isn't just a monument, it's a love poem written in stone. But beyond its romantic allure, it's also a symbol of India's rich cultural and architectural heritage. The Taj Mahal's design, which seamlessly blends elements of Persian, Islamic, and Indian architecture, is a testament to the cosmopolitan spirit of the Mughal Empire. Today, it's recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site and attracts millions of visitors every year. A monument to love, the Taj Mahal stands as an enduring symbol of India. From the east, we return to the Americas, to the cliff dwellings of Mesa Verde. Here, in the southwestern corner of Colorado, we find an extraordinary testament to the architectural prowess and cultural vibrancy of the ancestral Puebloans. These ancient architects and artisans, skilled in stone masonry, carved whole communities out of the sheer cliff faces. This wasn't a mere act of survival, but a reflection of their deep reverence for nature and the elements. Each alcove dwelling, kiva, and plaza tells a story of a people intricately woven into the tapestry of the land. For over 700 years, these cliff dwellings served as a hub of ancestral Puebloan society, a bustling center of commerce, art, and spirituality. Then, in the late 13th century, they left, leaving behind a silent stone testament to their existence. Nestled in the cliffs, Mesa Verde provides a glimpse into the lives of the ancestral Puebloans. It's a reminder that every rock, every monument, every ruin carries within it a piece of our shared human story. Leaving the cliffs, we journey to the jungle, to the Maya metropolis of Tikal. Nestled in the heart of Guatemala's rainforest, Tikal was once a thriving center of Maya civilization. From the late first century AD, it flourished for nearly a thousand years, its temples and palaces echoing with the hum of a bustling city. The grandeur of Tikal reveals the sophistication of Maya architecture and urban planning. Sky-high temples like the impressive Temple of the Jaguar pierce the jungle canopy while intricate hieroglyphs tell tales of powerful rulers and divine gods. But Tikal was more than just a city. It was a hub of economic, political, and cultural life, where art, science, and spirituality intertwined. The Maya calendar, a masterpiece of astronomical calculation, reflects their profound understanding of the cosmos. Yet for all its brilliance, Tikal fell into decline, swallowed by the jungle, but its spirit lives on. Lost in the jungle, Tikal stands as a testament to the grandeur of the Maya civilization. Uh, from the jungle, we travel to the island of Java, to the Buddhist masterpiece of Borobudur. This colossal stone structure, rising majestically from the verdant landscape, is a testament to the artistry and devotion of the ancient Javanese people. Constructed in the 8th and 9th centuries, Borobudur is an architectural marvel, built without the use of mortar and intricately adorned with over 2,000 relief panels and 500 Buddha statues. The monument represents the Buddhist concept of the universe, a cosmic mountain that pilgrims ascend in a spiritual journey towards enlightenment. Each level symbolizes a stage in the attainment of Buddhahood, a profound testament to the deep-seated Buddhist traditions that permeated the region. Borobudur is not merely an architectural wonder, but a cultural beacon. It's a living testament to the rich tapestry of Indonesian history and a symbol of the enduring spiritual quest for wisdom and enlightenment. A journey to enlightenment, Borobudur remains the world's largest Buddhist monument. From Java, we journey to the Syrian desert, to the oasis city of Palmyra. Once a flourishing trade hub, Palmyra's strategic location along caravan routes saw it rise to prominence. It was the heart of the ancient Palmyrene Empire, a civilization rich in culture and history. This enchanting city, with its monumental ruins, tells tales of prosperity, grandeur, and time's relentless march. Despite its turbulent past, Palmyra stands as a symbol of resilience and beauty. Our journey through time and across continents draws to a close. We ventured through Peru's cloud-shrouded Machu Picchu, traced the Great Wall's winding path, and stood in the Colosseum's echoing arena. We've marveled at Petra's rosy hues, the Acropolis's democratic birthplace, and the sacred legacy of Angkor Wat. 
From the Maya marvels to the Pharaoh's tribute, the Greco-Roman gem to the prehistoric puzzle, and to all of the beautiful ancient ruins around the world. Thank you guys for watching. If you made it this far into the video, make sure to like and subscribe for more content.